hi ladies you're welcome back to another video on this channel i film all these ladies because it's based on popular demand i saw that some of the short videos that i posted most of you viewed more of makeup it's not as if this video is for professionals this is just my regular makeup routine if you're a beginner at makeup then this will help i filmed a previous video on how to carve your eyebrow i will link that video somewhere around here without further ado let's jump right into the video i know you told your friend you're not okay you need your eyebrow bro you need something like this and then you need this as well your foundation concealer you need your eye pencil right? so you brush brush out your eyebrows it's, it's as simple as abc follow the natural line of your eyebrow lift your eyebrows up and line it make sure your eye pencil is well sharpened then you fill it in slightly with slight stroke You check. I'll go in with my concealer again. This is where this comes in. Then you blend it. Part of the things I teach on this channel is elegance. As classy ladies, our makeups are usually very, very faint and light. You don't have to make it very thick. If you want, you can go in with your foundation on the upper part. But if you don't want, you can leave it like so. All you need to do is just, if you don't want, you just use this to get a sharp edge on top. Then you apply your foundation. But if it is not too clear enough for you, you just put a little drop of your foundation over your head. Then this is even too much. You know, I'll blend my face. With the foundation at the end of the day you may not even notice let me blend in the foundation one thing i have in mind is that this part of my face looks smoother and awake and prepared than this time uh, when i am now ready to apply my foundation i am not going to be i'm not going to amass it here because i already have some quantity so ladies I'm going to go ahead to do the same on this other end. Just keep practicing with time. Nobody will even notice. I think it has to do with personal development. And something that only you can observe. So, you know, we already have a little part of makeup here. So you just put it on this part of your face that glows. You don't need so much foundation, ladies. So this is just enough for me. Less is more as far as makeup is concerned. I do not solicit planting my face with makeup products. I like to look a bit natural. You don't even need to have professional. It can be absorb the rest of the foundation. Now your eyes so you have an even blend. If you want to go the extra mile, you can put some foundation. This is actually going to change your look. Under your eye, as I see them do, on your nose, you know, then here to highlight and give you that glow. All these parts are going to make you do. I use the same thing for everything. Remember, I said this tutorial is not for professionals. I myself, I wouldn't say I am professional, but I know that I am better than some people. This is how I do my makeup, and I thought I shared it with you lately. Many people think I go to professionals to make my face. Trust you, this is how I do it. Anytime I show up here, then I put some on my forehead just so I have that glow. So the corners of my eyes are looking dull. I'm just going to dab this just to give it that bright look. To line your eyes, it has the eyeliner here. So I'm just going to use my camera. I'm not using any mirror. You just follow the natural line downwards. Ladies, doing makeup and talking at the same time can actually alter a lot of things. So, 
But just observe what I'm doing, okay? If you are wondering, I am not putting on powder because the weather is somewhat cold. But if the weather is hot, I will need to powder my face. Because it's a natural look makeup, it doesn't need so much on it. So I'm going to line my lips and put on my lipstick. I'll just use this. It's close to the color of my lips. It's nude. Very good. How do I look? Now my face is becoming a little bit oily. I just go in with this powder and this brush lightly. Powder my face to have that cool feel. Not just, it's not as if I'm powdering anything really, not dry. So if you're trying this for the first time, I would advise you allow this to dry before you do this. This may not really look as professional as those, uh, in quotes, professional makeup artists on YouTube make. But trust you me, this makeup I just did is a lifesaver because a lot of ladies can't even achieve this look on their own. So ladies, I want to believe that this video was helpful to you. If you learned something, I just want to give it a huge thumbs up. If you're not subscribed yet, please join in the phone. Hit that subscribe button. Make sure to turn on your post notifications. If you want me to make more makeup videos, please let me know in the comment section. I love you all so much ladies. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.